All right, here we are at the RCA display. And this is the RCA Select Division Video Disc Player. This is the same video disc player, whoops, <laughs> that <laughs> she's on tape forever now. Anyway, uh, the same video disc player that was uh, described by uh, the man at Advent at the press conference last night as being uh, a toy. <laughs> so we'll have to take a look closer and see exactly what the toy looks like. All right, this is a, a close-up shot of the RCA Select Division, and you can see that the um, the tape actually um, goes in. Can you get my finger in the in the shot here? Do we have it? Okay, this is the slot right there along that rim where the uh, cassette actually goes in. These are this is some of the packaging that you can see sticking out here uh, for the uh, the various discs with a lever here on the side. A uh, big silver lever that uh, indicates whether you are in the off position, play position, or the load or unload position on this thing. It's a rather simple looking device, so it'll probably sell very well because most of the people are pretty simple, they'll probably own it. Wouldn't you say, Ray? For sure, for sure. Very lengthy, just to, oh, <laughs> speaking of not very lengthy, <laughs> starts it already. Hey, thanks a lot, Ray. Ray's a magnificent cameraman. We'll never let him do this again after this. Arlene Smith. Arlene, where are you from? I'm from Las Vegas. Las Vegas, right yeah. here in LV. Mm -hmm. Ever see Robert Eric walking down the streets or anything like this? No, no. Were you no, around hardly. when that awful fire happened? Yes, I was here. Oh my. You probably terrible. never forget that as long as you live, no, huh? No, it was real sad. Oh uh, boy, I tell you, we got some of the uh, um, damage even on, on the videotape here. It's just, I was just here uh, yeah. less than a year ago for the uh, NAB convention. and. It's kind of scary to see the place that you had dinner at, you know, like I, a, know. I hope they get it all fixed up. Anyway, the new revolution here is RCA display. Now, I've got some friends at RCA in Detroit, and they're always getting on me because I got all Sony equipment, and I'm on the beta format, and he keeps trying to convert me over to VHS. But I've got my RCA VHS, too, so uh, I can't say that I'm exclusively non-RCA. Now, this machine last night was referred by somebody at another major company as a toy. He says, wait till you see the new RCA. It's a real neat toy. Yeah. For people that want the quality video disc system, they're going to go with the laser system. Now, what do you got to say about that? Is this, a, in your opinion, is this a toy, or have they kept it ultra simple so that everybody could learn how to work it? Extremely easy. And for one, I want to correct you. This one is not the laser system. I know it isn't. This, okay. He said the laser system is the quality system, but this is the Tinker Toy. Okay, this now, is very, very, very easy to operate. Why don't you show us? Okay, all you have to do is push it to the unload position. Right now, it is loaded. Okay. So slide this in. This is the jacket. You pull out and this is the no. disc right in here. Is the disc now in the machine or still the in the jacket? It's in here. It's, it's in, in the here. jacket. It's okay. in the jacket. Okay. Right here it indicates the side, side one. one. Side one and side, side two. two. Each side has 60 minutes so it's a two hour plane disc. Okay what happens uh, Arlene when a movie is over two hours in length? Uh, okay then you have another disc. That goes so there will, be a, there will be an additional disc mm -hmm. for the remaining however much time. Right. I understand. Okay. okay. Now, how do we stick this thing in? All you have to do is so simple, a child could do it. Slide it in, slide it out, and your disc is now in the machine. It stays in there. Right. So you move it from the load, unload position, yes. and you put it on to play. Mm -hmm. And all you have to do is wait eight seconds, and right here on the screen... We can pop up here on the screen, Ray. We'll see eight seconds later we should see a picture. It gives it enough time to get speed going. Okay. Now, is this the RCA no, a logo that we have on the front right. end? Uh, does it's it say RCA. RCA logo? Mm hmm. Okay. It always looks good on your Sony TVs. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. Now, can we stop that picture if we wanted to? No, we do not have what you call a, a freeze a motion. Freeze frame. We have a pause. Okay, when you push but the it pause, okay, it, it takes out right. the picture. Could, do you think an electronics wizard could fix that so that when you push that, you'd still have a picture? Um, I'm feet, not sure. You know, See, I'll like have to... with this, we have like you have a record. It's yeah. just almost like a record. Right. And is it have still frames. spinning in there? Yes, it is still, it's spinning, still spinning. Well, it's on pause, okay, but so it's I... lifted up. The, oh, the needle has the lifted off there. Oh, has it has been lifted, been lifted off there. So there's no wear on the. So, okay, then you couldn't freeze it then. No. no. Okay, I understand. Now, how so fast you when you lift? Pause. It's pretty quick. Within about a second and a half or so. After right. it comes back, the picture comes on the screen. If we can show that one more time, right? Okay. If I hit the pause. We are now in pause, come back up to the screen, and you'll see that after we hit it, it takes about two seconds, maybe a second and a half, two seconds before our picture's back. Right. Um, what have we got here with rapid access and visual search? Okay, I'll explain that to you. The visual search 
goes at 16 times the regular speed. The regular speed, if you'll notice right now, okay. the regular speed is at 450 RPMs. Okay. So this is 16 times that. All right. And you can reverse it. That's going the other way now? Right. Okay. Now, your rapid access, if you wanted to go forward real fast, right here you have the play time, so that's minutes into the movie. Oh. So if you wanted a rapid access... Go up, let's say, let's say we want to go up 20 minutes in the movie. Right. And that goes at 200 times the regular speed. Oh. Okay. So we can take that up. To, now we're right. 17 minutes, now we're 18, now we're 20 minutes right. into the movie. And that goes how, on immediately. Okay, also. however, folks, as you can see, when we do that, She's got a digital playing time here that actually shows. Ray, why don't you come around just a little ways here and see, we'll come right in here. This indicates 20 minutes into the movie. So we're 20 minutes into the Muppet movie right now. But when she would hit this random access number, the screen did go blank. So you do not see it moving that fast because I presume the stylus is lifted. The stylus is lifted from, and moved over. And moved over, I see. So that's so. very interesting. Now, now, if you got to the end of the film, let's say, mm -hmm. then you will see that it goes on M. It says E for end. Oh, really? Right, and that's when you know that it's time to turn it over. Okay. Now, when you turn it over, do you have a rewind time, or do you have a time that it has to get back to the beginning, or do you pop it out Eight right at that point? Eight seconds again. I'll show you what happens. Okay. okay we're getting to the end to right two. now. There it is. Okay. So what you do is you push it to load. Simple as that. Slide it in. Slide it in. Bring it out, and there's your disc again. Turn it around. Slide it in again, and there you and go. You're all set. And Put it on play, and that's all there is to it. Well, that is simple. That is unbelievably simple. Now, what is the selling price in most retail stores going to be for this particular unit? Okay, retail will be four ninety nine ninety five. Five hundred dollars. Right, and uh, these will sell retail at. 15 to 25 dollars depending on which film it is how right. long what have you right obviously the hottest ones will be more expensive sure. the garbage will go for a lesser price uh -huh. right so uh, how many titles do you think you're going to have does, does we any will, we will have a hundred as of march titles. 22nd is when it will be available okay is there a brochure out yet uh, not listing at the this uh, titles point. no I not think yet they're keeping it a secret right no, now son of a gun <laughs> okay well listen i truly appreciate it very much um, Arlene, uh, if you could come back up here, <laughs> Ray. <laughs> Ray is ready for the network. We won't say which network, the blue okay. network, I think. Anyway, keep it level. You're tilting the camera, Ray. <laughs> anyway, and uh, we, we're going to probably show this to some of the uh, video files around the country that are interested in the newest in technology here at CES 1981. All right, well, listen, we were all set to leave the RCA booth when, lo and behold, I said, is there any way that you can see? <laughs> you got <a> to <laughs> warn me when you do things like that, guy. Anyway, uh, and all of a sudden, I said to, to, to Ar Arlene, right? right? I said, hey, how, you can't see this. You see, if you look at this thing, it is completely sealed up. This is the edge right here, and you can't get your little hands on it because if you, if you stick your hands on this disc, I understand it's, it's detrimental to the machine. So therefore, uh, since there'll be lots of little rug rats using these things all over the country, I love children. Anyway, um, you're gonna, they wanna make it so that you can slip it in. So we've got a unit here that has got a, uh, I guess a plexiglass top here, glass, so that you can see actually inside. This is, I presume, the platter inside at which it rides. Where the stylus is on this thing, which underneath this particular part of the unit right there. So she'll stick it in here and we'll take a look and see, boom. And there's the, oh, it's black. It looks just like a record. So it looks just like a record. Now, is it, uh, okay, is it turning? We'll put it on the she, play position. She puts it on the play position. Now yeah. it's firing up. You can see the, the center of it uh, as it gains speed. Yeah, and it's I'm getting... going to put you on a rapid axis so you can see it move quickly. Okay. okay, and then she's putting on a rapid axis. This is 200 times the regular speed, like I said before, so, so it doesn't it. normally go this fast. Nowhere near that fast. We're across. at number 20 right now, so... Okay, so where is the stylus actually? Right about here, right? Right. Right under here. If you ever had to change it, this access door right here, all you have to do oh, it, bring it, out the, bring it out, put it back in. How, it, how long does the needle last, you suppose? Over six years at least. Oh, you're kidding, really? Six years? The consumer can change that easily and it will. Any idea what a replacement would cost? They say. $68. $68, that's not that awfully that's bad. They say, the, they say the worst part of the video recorder is to replace the heads. It's like mm -hmm. placing the picture tube in a TV set. Well, that's absolutely fantastic. Well, again, I thank you very much, and that's a dramatic demonstration, and I can't wait to, uh, in fact, just for the heck of it, why don't, why don't you say, uh, 
Um, hold on one second, give me a pause. Okay, so that's gonna just about wrap things up here at the RCA booth. Thank you, Arlene, very much for showing us all this stuff. Oh, you're welcome. And quite uh, well. I'll let them all see it in Detroit, okay? Say hi to everybody in Detroit. Hi, everybody in Detroit. <laughs> and you're from here in Las Vegas. Mm -hmm. Incredible. Talk to you later.